Hey, Mars Reviews here, and I've been asked by the people from Noodle Studio to take a look at their new Sundance animated short, Black Holes, How Embarrassing to Be Human. I find it very funny that the first thing a studio has ever asked me to do a review of is a movie about a mission to Mars. Funny. Alright, so the premise for this short film is fucking weird. I'm not even going to sugarcoat it. It's pretty far-fetched. Even the synopsis they gave me kind of makes me go, what the fuck is this? Black Holes is a story about the main character Dave, an astronaut going on the first ever mission to Mars. Everything seems all great, he's having a good time, you know, he's gonna be the first person on Mars, he's getting bitches, he's feeling all important, he's getting fame, he's eating his favorite flan. But then he gets teamed up with, and I'm not bullshitting here, with a sentient watermelon that sends him into a state of insecure paranoia. What? It's weird. Not really in a bad way though. The film's writing is actually pretty great. I never thought anyone could write a fucking melon to be intimidating, but the short film did it. The film is obviously really inspired by movies like 2001 A Space Odyssey, even to the extent where they recreate scenes in CGI. Speaking of CGI, this movie looks really damn good. The CGI to me really looks like it's trying to imitate a claymation or stop motion kind of feel. I'm not really sure if that's what the creator were going for but I still think it looks really damn good. I like the really weird and kind of veiny designs in this film. Even though most of the characters honestly look like they resemble a human thumb, I still think it looks really good. That may sound a little bit harsh, but I think the creators are pretty self-aware with characters having names like Dr. Finger or having a bunch of thumb iconography in the background. Another thing I'm really impressed by is the texture work on this film. The textures on the characters are really great looking, and coming from about three animators, this is a really high achievement, and the score is pretty good too. I never heard of these two artists, but I have heard of Flying Lotus due to collaboration with two of my favorite artists. If any of this looks somewhat interesting to you, go check it out. And if you want to see more, donate to their Kickstarter. They're hoping to raise enough money to fund a Black Holes adult animated TV series, and I'm always interested in more prospects for adult animation, and if you share the same sentiment, you should probably donate a dollar or two.